Well, folks, I'm sorry about the uh, quick uh, cutoff on that last video. thought I had put on plenty of room. Before I get into the next message, uh, I wanted to finish by telling you what I do. When I go to Jesus in, in, for intercession, I come to, or intense prayer, I come to him in prayer. I ask that he cover me and what I am in intercession for by his blood and be protected. Then I close my eyes and I see a white room with benches on either side and three thrones on top of like a platform similar to a church. Either side I uh, see benches and the angels are standing in front of them and they're full. I see them all as white light, the Trinity, except the angels. I see them white, of course, but they have form. I see myself and Phil much younger. I do not see my face, but I usually am in a white robe. I walk up the aisle and carry what I am bringing to the Lord. It could be anything. I lay it on the stairs in front of him, and then I stand back in the aisle in front of them. I sometimes go to my knees and pray. Sometimes I have sang to him, danced for him, and have even been flat on my face in worship, crying, weeping, whatever. No matter what I am doing, uh, be, uh, behind me the angels are doing the same thing. I do not always have something to bring him. Sometimes I just go to him and praise and worship him. I have never heard a word from him. But there was one time I went in front of him and he came down to the aisle in front of the thrones where I was and he started to hug me. Then the Father the, and the Holy Spirit came down and hugged me too. I was in the middle and the three of them had their arms around me. It was one big hug. Then all of a sudden we all four turned into one brilliant white light. I grew taller. And then we went up a few levels. So, work on these things. It does work. It does happen. And many, many miraculous things have happened in the situations or the people that I have brought to them. Here's the message. The next step the, is the island. Message 333. Like you, at times, the world... E the evil, pain, uh, being tired, etc., can get me, get to me, and make me think that maybe I am not strong enough to get to do God's will. Last night, I asked him to please talk with me, or give me a dream and let me know just where we are. I did have a quick dream, and I was uh, talk in the dream. I was talking with Jesus, our Savior. I did not see anything, but I knew who it was, and he told me, the next step is the island. My children, I have told you of the things to come. Right now you are being refined and are more precious than gold, as you will be made perfect, perfect vessels. Right now you truly are doing my work, and that is very important, as every moment you are on the earth you are able to get closer to me stronger in faith and, and love and spread my truth there are so or I'm sorry there are some of you oh I am so sorry let me go right back here we go right now you truly are doing my work and that is very important every moment that you are on earth you are able to get closer to me stronger in faith and love and spread my truth there are so many things that you will do some of you will be taken to safety some of you will be taken to an island to rest transform and be trained for the next phase some of you will stay here to tell those around you what is happening as they see you spared the devastation around you to my glory and some will come back you will all help bring in the great harvest. You will see great things work through you, and so will everyone else. There will be sorrow on that strange and mournful day, 
but there will also be great joy and wonder. All is to my glory, and it, it, and it all will be truly glorious. You see, there will be many that will have no idea what is happening. There will be those that will not believe it because it will not be just as they thought it would be or when they thought it would be. You see, my timing is perfect, as is my love, redemption, grace, and plan, as, is, as it is through these, through me, that you are mine and you will be used as my vessel. You are being refined. You will come out of the ashes, and you will be, bring glory to my name and to my kingdom. All will go according to my plan, to my will, and to my glory, as I am God, and I am in control. Do not think you do not matter, that you cannot get through, that you are alone, as these thoughts are not true. I am with you all, and all will be fine. Seek first the kingdom of God. Bind yourself to me and let me take you to the next step, the next level, and to end in my anointing, in my grace, and my love. Come to me now. Come through the gate into my presence with a song of thanksgiving. Come into my courtyard with a song of praise. Give thanks and pr praise and rest in me. Let me strengthen you and love you. Yeshua. Things are coming on strong, folks. Let him work with you. Let him show you his way and his will. It will happen. I know it will. And I also know that we all thought, well, at least most of us, thought for sure that we would have been gone by now. But we don't know everything. And we don't know his plan. We really can trust in him. We can trust that he knows what he's doing. Give everything and everyone to him. Let him take over and stand strong. He will help you fight those demons. He will not let evil win. He is in control, and he will win the war. God bless you. I love you.